Okay, folks, welcome to Madam Farms. This is Carl. You can see this beautiful little bunny down here. Well, she had some babies last night in this box, but as you can see, she pulled almost no fur at all because she's a first time mama and she didn't know what she was doing. So the babies right now are inside the house with surrogate parent, human parents, who are going to be taking care of it and warming them up, breathing on them. Well, we're putting some extra old Angora fur that we have here into the box so that we can make a nice nest for the babies. Once we get this going on, they'll be nice and warm because when we came out this morning and found them out here, they were just freezing. Little tiny cold things in the bottom of the box. She had at least been smart enough, well, she had some of them even outside the box, so. Which fell through the bottom of the wire, but luckily we were out here in time that none of them died this morning. So there's a nice little nest box we're making out of old Angora world that had knots and things like that so it wasn't good for weaving but it was good for saving up for something we were going to originally idea was to stuff a pillow with it but it turned out that it was a perfect emergency fill the bunny box with i'm going to set this camera down so you can see the bunny from so you can see how she's missing the fur on the top of her head that's because this little guest who's not even our bunny Somebody asked him to hold him for a couple days and they have never come back to get him yet. Has been picking at the top of her head. At the top of her head, I can't believe it. So I'm gonna have to move him to a different cage or something. I don't know what I'm gonna have to do with him. But uh, that's just mean. So I'm gonna put this cage down, camera down real quick so I can put it. these boxes into the cage. Okay, well there's her cage. There's the mean bunny who's already trying to find a way to get over here and bite her now, as you can see. I don't know what's gonna happen to him. He's not my bunny, otherwise I'd just make stew out of him for being mean, but if the person doesn't come back for him, I don't know. I'll give him a couple more months, I guess, but. And there she is, she's now looking for her babies, as you can tell. We're gonna go in the house and get the babies, and I'm gonna pause this camera and come back out when we're putting the babies in, let you get a good look at each baby. So, um, thank you very much. Be right back with you in just a few seconds. This morning at Manu Farms, we found a bunch of baby bunnies. And you can see all the different babies. So there's seven of them here that we've counted. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we're gonna put them now back. Here, you wanna take that? Put them now back. And with their mother. And then with their mama. Mamas, look, we got the babies. Come on. That's Snowball. That's the one who's been biting. This one's the one that's been biting her. Next baby. Okay, let me get on the other so side. We put them down in this nice little nest pocket in here for them. Now, normally you wouldn't take the babies away from the mother at all. You wouldn't even be handling them this young. But, as I said, some of them fell through the bottom of the cage because she's a new mama and she didn't pull all her fur and we had to add some more fur to the box. So we're making special circumstances this time. Here's the father right here. Hold on, sorry, I'm not good with the camera. There's the father. Curious the guy, isn't he? Okay, now we'll push that back over here away from okay. him so that she'll feel comfortable there. Oh, poor baby stomach and having pain, so... Okay, go check out your babies, babies. Go check out your babies, they're all good now. Okay, so the best thing we can really do at this point, I can cover that up a little bit so that they're warm. The best thing we can do really at this point is just leave them be, let mama do what she would naturally do on her own. Alright, well thank you folks. Um, 
Cool. Checking out the bunnies. We'll be giving you probably daily updates here as the bunnies get bigger. And we name them and so forth and so forth until they're on one of our plates. All right, enjoy.